Hi, I'm Susan Stiffelman, and I'm the author of Parenting Without Power Struggles, Raising Joyful, Resilient Kids While Staying Cool, Calm, and Connected. And in my work, one of the cornerstones is this notion of you as a parent being what I call the captain of the ship in your child's life. Let me tell you what that looks like. This will represent you as the parent, my right hand, and this is the child. Notice that the parent hand is above the child's. It's a hierarchy. It doesn't mean you're in control or, you know, a throwback to the 50s where you're bossing your kids around, but it means that you're in charge. So the child might say, can I have a piece of cake? And maybe it's not a good idea for them to have cake. So you'll say, honey, not right now. Why not? Watch carefully. Because you won't eat your dinner. Yes, I will. No, sweetheart. I gave you cake last night and you didn't eat your dinner. That's because you made meatloaf. I hate meatloaf. You notice who's in charge here? Nobody. <laughs> I call this the two lawyers. Whoever is the most committed to getting what they want and the least exhausted is going to prevail. And you know who that is? If you're a parent, you know that that's likely to be the child. They'll just wear you down with these power struggles, pushbacks, and negotiations. But it gets worse. If you don't give me cake, says the child, I'm not eating my dinner. Oh, yes, you are, young lady, because otherwise you're going straight to your room. When you're down here, the quickest way of identifying yourself as being here is that you're feeling desperate and you're bribing and threatening. So everything that you'll learn in my, my work, in my book, in the webinars that I offer will have to do with how you hold this place in your child's life. You know, we all want a captain. Every ship needs a captain. We want a captain, though, who's calm and confident no matter how stormy or rough the seas become. If you hear the whoop, whoop alarm of a ship and you see your captain leaping overboard, you're going to be pretty worried. Or if you have a captain who's negotiating, a passenger might say, I don't like the orange life vest, and he's trying to sort it out between you and someone who might have the green one. You don't want that either. In the midst of a crisis, you want the captain who knows what he's doing or she's doing and can handle it. Our kids want that. They want to know that if they're having a problem at school or with a friend or even within the family, you can handle it. We teach our kids whether we are the captain or whether we can't handle their truth in the ways we react when they tell the truth. So everything that you're going to learn in my work has to do with helping kids deal with frustration, disappointment, aggression, anger, meltdowns, homework, screen time, TV, all the issues that you face as a parent every day and handle those as a captain of the ship. So within attachment, which you'll learn from my work, within a strong connection, you can hold this place where you're not reacting, you're responding as a calm, confident captain of the ship that your kids need you to be. Welcome to my Parenting Without Power Struggles world and I hope you'll join us.